Hello, good morning or good evening to everyone. Welcome to Mainframe Brex Tutorials. You're watching Mainframe Tutorials. So, this video is about showing you the Rex concatenation operator so and how it will be used using Rex, Rex programming. So, so with this, uh, uh, from this, I'm going to connect to the main terminal, writing Rex program, executing, and showing you the results of concatenation operator works. So, before we go to the mainframe terminal, that just to give an introduction to this concatenation operator, the concatenation operator combines two terms into one. That is, the term can be strings. Uh, it can be either strings, variables, expressions, or constraints. Concatenation can be significant in formatting. So let me connect to the mainframe and show you how it works so I'm connected to the mainframe so you have created a separate PDS data set and you have created a separate member for Lex as you know the standard rules that your member should always be a 80 column and your Rex program always should start with the with this comment that is slash star Rex and slash star slash then you here you have declared four different kinds of variables that is string 1 string 2 string 3 and string 4 string 1 is storing B is uh, string 2 is storing space A and self and starter okay so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to concatenate all this, uh, this string three and string four, so that it will just be uh, stay, uh, stay with the uh, self hyphen starter. So you you'll be seeing these differences. See, I'll be showing you how what the difference is. is how let's see how uh, this statement will throw onto the screen. So as usual, we'll go to start and uh, we'll uh, type it as. Uh, KTSO exec and uh, followed by your data set name, followed by the member and followed by the program. Okay, so it's you can see it here as a BA self starter. So you can see a space already given by a different uh, when you are giving a pasting a different kinds of variable names. So it is separating by a space. The I mean the variables are separated by a space by default. So here, for you, when you are trying to concatenate three different two different variables, there is no space. There is no space is here. So you can see it, it has been the two words has been concatenated. So here is what. So you have concatenated this. Whereas for this a and self, you can see a different thing. So I will try to execute it again, and you can see what the difference is. See. A after A there is a space and uh, for this there is no space. Okay, let's what we'll do is just I will try to remove this. Okay, and you can see the difference. What happens if I uh, remove that or concatenation operator? Okay, see you can see a space right. So that's what's the difference. So I'll try to update it back. Okay. Okay. Save it and uh, try to run it again. Okay. To see, I'm saying you this is very very important. So when you write a complex Rx program, so these or boolean operators, arithmetic operations, this all will be very very important. So you need to practice a lot while working this. Uh, uh, and just try to use uh, concatenation. You try to use, try to concatenate uh, a, a string, a numeric, and alpha numeric, and uh, anything about different kinds of variables, data. So just, uh, just keep practicing and keep learning. And with this, I want to conclude this video. And I will be coming up with uh, many other videos. So, so stay tuned to maintain tutorials. Thank you for watching, have a great and pleasurable day or an evening.